All right, so thanks for watching this video. Uh, my name is Shane with Shaner Media, and I just wanted to share with you a little bit about scheduling and how I schedule uh, my appointments. Let's just adjust this camera here. How's that? There we go. All right, so I use what's uh, known as a desktop calendar very easy you can use it obviously in your cell phone and all that kind of stuff but um, I like a more of a physical type person where I like to actually see everything at a glance so in the mornings I'll actually review my calendar and see what's coming down the pipes so for September is basically done so as you can see here this the all the circles are the video shoots that I had and then the check boxes are when I've actually completed them. So sometimes what will happen is you'll book an appointment and then for whatever reason, uh, that book, the appointment either gets earlier or it gets extended uh, later as well. Uh, so instead of a half day, maybe it's a full day video shoot or it gets bumped from Tuesday to Wednesday or Saturday to Monday, whatever it is, it's just nice to have everything at a glance and you can actually uh, rearrange your schedule accordingly. So last week of September is gone. So what I do is I just tear that up, tear it off, and then I fold it up and I keep it for uh, review for next year. So when I uh, look at my entire calendar for the year, I can actually see what video shoots I had done and all that kind of stuff. So, so things are starting to shape up. I have to pencil in a couple of shoots. I only have one shoot right now scheduled. Uh, but I know through my church, there's a couple more shoots coming up as well. Um, and then what I also did is I put into November. You can see there in the top, November 2nd, there's uh, what's called an oil oil field Christian Fellowship group. So it's a networking group uh, that's going to be on... Thursday morning so I put that in my calendar as well so that when I'm doing my video shoots I will work around that I won't double book myself on that day uh, and it's early enough in the morning that I can still do my other job which is great so I would encourage you to get a calendar like this so that you can stay on top of being more organized and then at the bottom if you need extra notes like uh, what you're going to charge or how much you've charged on this project, how long it took. Uh, you need to put those notes there as well. And you can always transfer them later to your cell phone, um, whatever works for you. But for now, I like the desktop calendar. If you have a better way of doing things, uh, I don't mind you sending a comment. Share with me what you do. Uh, but for me, this works, again, because you have everything at a glance and if you have a partner or a spouse or a significant other it's nice that everybody can see what's going on so that you don't accidentally double book yourself so there you go so i hope this video helps and have a fantastic day